subscribe before you close your eyes. For today's video, I have a weekly grocery haul to share with you. This week I went to Kroger and you'll see it's pretty small and very random, 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 because we are leaving.
Okay, and then I grabbed these um, kombucha. These are the Brew Doctor Organic Kombucha Tasty and Fizzy Probiotic Tea. This is Island Mango, which is mango, pa passion fruit, and green tea, and I got two of those. Sweet. 
Ambition the Burn with sports nutrition for every ambition. Honey Stinger Sweets sweetens the burn to help you push through any challenge. More than 1,000 pro and college teams plus a generation of endurance athletes prepare, perform, and recover with Honey Stinger to help achieve their performance goals and feel better along the way. Energy Waffle, a thin layer of organic honey infused filling sandwiched between two thin gluten-free waffles. Best consumed before or during activity. And my husband likes these too, so... It's a perfect snack for us to travel with. Okay, um, I grabbed some grapes.
tried to make this like cornbread mix for my parents. It's one like you mix it up in a, a mason jar, like the dry ingredients. And then when you're ready to bake it, you would just add the eggs and the milk. And I'm not sure what I was thinking, but I used masa flour instead of cornmeal. And y'all, it did not work well at all. I I made a batch for myself um, just to test it out to make sure it was good before giving it to my parents. And it was not good. It was weird. It literally, the cornbread tasted like a freaking tortilla, okay? It literally tasted like a giant cornbread tortilla. And it was weird. It just was not right. Um, so yeah, I needed to get cornmeal, which is what the recipe calls for. And I am just a goofball and I'm not sure what I was doing. So I'm going to make these for my parents. Uh, those cornbread mixes with the right ingredient, the cornmeal. still watching at this point in the video, why don't you leave me a corn emoji? A corn, corn, corn emoji. Okay, and then um, I just needed more baking powder. I needed to make the cornbread mixes. I was just out, so. This is non-GMO Project Verified. It's the Rumford brand, and actually, I I had never seen this brand before moving um, to Kentucky. I've never seen it in like the Seattle area. Maybe it just weren't at the stores I was shopping at, but I really like this brand. They also make um, cornstarch and look at how few ingredients are in here. Cornstarch, sodium bicarbonate, and monocalcium phosphate. This does not have the aluminum powder in it like most of the other baking powder brands do. So um, I will be getting this kind from now on because I don't want that aluminum in there. Um, it is gluten-free, double acting. So yeah, I'm so excited to have this brand now. here. So this is the second thing I picked up at Walmart, Walmart a few days ago, but just like the dried peaches, I put it in this haul because, um, it's part of our travel snacks. So these are the organic dried mango strips. Mango, mango. I love dried mango. So good. This is one of the other things I always kept in my bag when I was a flight attendant was dried mango. Shaped cookies, classic biscuits with healthy crunch 
burgers with beef, chicken, and bacon. These are the little ones, like very small. That way they can get two cookies like spaced out throughout the day. And they think they're getting, you know, an extra cookie, but really it's just two that are the same size as one of the bigger ones. Um, we ran out of cookies yesterday, and Archie and Winnie always get a cookie when my husband leaves for work. <laughs> and we didn't have any to give them this morning. And Winnie, when I tell you, Winnie was pissed. She was furious. <laughs> she was pouting literally the whole time. So these are actually the main reason I went to the store because she has been just beside herself that she did not receive 